o'clock at night and I'm finally picking up the camera today so obviously you guys are not gonna see the kids in today's vlog and honestly we really didn't do all that much I'm sorry you guys are like I don't know how when I don't allow the kids to touch the camera anymore that it still gets dirty <laughs> maybe because they still do touch it when they're not supposed to um I'm trying to think of what we even did today. Cole went to school. He learned said that today he learned about being patient. patient but that's not the word he used. Waiting. waiting. And he said that's another good thing to learn at school. Um, Chris edited Cole's vlog tonight. What do you think? Did it turn out good? Yeah. How many stars will you give it, Chris? How many stars will I give the video? Yeah. In comparison to the Good Families Don't video? No, don't compare it because nothing I think will ever truly compare to that first one. I mean, something might in the future, but right now, that one was... If you have not seen Cole read Good Families Don't on, his, on their channel, which the channel is listed down below, um, go check that out. Because you're never going to hear a more animated kid reading. It is awesome. Okay, back to Little Ninja That Could. I'm giving eight. He was kind of getting tired of reading this one. Um, there's a part, I don't know if you guys have ever read The Little Ninja That Could, but there's a part that it talks about dolls with blue eyes and, blonde, and yellow curls and dolls with brown eyes. And it says brown bobbed head meaning that they had like short hair and he could not say bobbed and he had to like redo that clip probably a good five or ten times like he could not say bobbed he kept saying brown bobbled heads and I probably would have left it as bobbled but the next word was heads so that wasn't gonna work out um, so that's what Chris did he worked today um, we are, well, he's doing dishes right now. I'm about to, I'm waiting for Cole's video to actually be done, um, uploading onto the computer, and then, um, I can download the clips that are on this SD card so I can edit yesterday's vlog, because that's still not up yet. <laughs> I've been really on top of things today. I need to get better at that. Tomorrow I'm gonna get better. Tomorrow I'm going to vlog myself doing laundry and just being better at vlogging in general. Um, I finished some homework tonight. I'm trying to think. This is gonna be the shortest vlog in the world because that's really all that we did today. Grocery shopping. Christmas grocery shopping. We got some stuff for me to bake, some treats for the baby shower that I am 
um, part hosting with other people. I'm kind of excited. With my baby shower with Cole, my sister did this game where she put safety pins in a bowl of rice and you had like a minute to like, and you were blindfolded or you had your eyes closed to try to get as many safety pins out of the rice that you can. Believe it or not, it's really hard to do. So that's something we're doing. I'm making those um, cupcakes. Chris said that's maybe something we'll have to do for our vlog. Maybe that could be for one of my random Fridays on my channel. Um, and yeah, we got stuff to make. Cupcakes for it. More pumpkin bars because you can't go wrong with pumpkin bars. Um, that's about it. I'm trying to think. I really think that's about it. I mean, kids or kids today. Shane has gotten to the point where he knows what he wants to watch on TV. Well, you can make noise. That's fine. Cole has, not Cole, Shane has gotten to the point where he knows what he wants to watch on TV now and he feels that he deserves to have a turn just like the other boys. The only problem is he can't really tell you what he wants to watch and so you have to pick him up and he will point at it at the TV because we have Netflix and that's how he tells you but then even then once you start it he'll realize that's not what he wants to watch and so today has kind of just been a battle with him and him he's at this he's at the stage in his life where he wants more independence like his brothers but it's really not possible for him to have all that much more independence so it's just really he's at a really weird stage um, Ira, Ira was actually really good today. I mean, there were a few things that we had to correct him on, um, but m for the most part, he was really good, and I say that like he's a, hor a horrible kid all the time, but that's not true. He just has a hard time with Shane, because Shane and Ira are, like, exactly alike. Like, I wish I could, like, find, Chris has a bunch of footage of Ira from when he was Shane's age and their mannerisms and everything are exactly alike and so they are like yeah, they're different but they're like the same kid and I think Ira just cannot handle the fact that his brothers just like him and it drives him crazy but for today I think he only pushed him down once and that's you know really good compared to other days where he pushes him down and then tries to like punch his head and stuff so he was really good um and like I said Ira is a really good kid he he's working on things so please don't judge him badly um Cole was pretty good today and that's that's pretty much it the video is done uploading so I'm going to let you guys go so I can finish so I can edit this vlog and yesterday's vlog so it'll just be done for tomorrow so I can go help out in the kitchen. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. I'm sorry I didn't pick up the camera till late again today. And sorry the kids aren't in it. And sorry you had to see this mug the whole time. So we will see you guys tomorrow. Bye.